All right, I'm gonna drop a crazy TQ on you. TQ stands for test question. So if you see a patient with osteomas plus familial adenomatous polyposis, you should be thinking Gardner syndrome. There's two other things though that they can test you on with Gardner syndrome that are obscenely high yield and a lot of students don't know them. So I'll give you two seconds to think about it and then I'll tell you. So the other things that you'll see is congenital hypertrophy of the RPE, the retinal pigmented epithelium. And so the RPE congenital hypertrophy is literally 97% specific for your Gardner syndrome. And then the other thing to look for is supranumerary teeth, which you will also see with Job syndrome, which if you recall is hyper IgE syndrome. Gotta know that, gotta know Gardner syndrome, Job syndrome. One more time, let's recap. So Gardner, you'll see osteomas as well as FAP. And then these patients also will have supernumerary teeth as well as congenital hypertrophy of the RPE, the retinal.